I'm back from Canada. I just did my assignment, so now we're ready to make a video. Hey guys, it's me, Danny Tim, and today we're going to be talking about Rainbow's Black Swan. I just want to let you guys know there are two ways you can view this video. So, uh, I'm just going to tell you the way I viewed it at first, and then the second way I viewed it after I read other people's comments. So, yes, uh, let's begin. Let's go. I hurt my shoulder. I really shouldn't be doing this. <laughs> What's really powerful about this video is how the girls show a very, very strong emotion, and that's fear. And I don't think people actually notice that in K-pop videos, they don't really show you that emotion. All they usually show is like sadness or happiness, sadness or happiness. You know, someone's either crying, someone's out there wearing colorful pants and prancing around the room. But here, the girls are really scared, you know. And since the song is called Black Swan, um, if you guys know what the theory is, the theory is kind of like they're, they're, they've seen something unpredictable. That's probably why in the beginning of the video, Jaekyung looked into the peephole and she saw something that was unpredictable or something that she didn't want to see. Can we just talk about every scene that kind of expresses fear? Let's talk about how like first Jaekyung is like on a chair and is surrounded by water. Honey, I don't know about you, but I'd be calling the plumber company because that shit ain't normal. And what about Jisook when she's like holding onto the wall as their paint or blood, whatever, that's gushing through there? Honey, honey, do you know what that means? Do you know what that means? The hashtag slasher is there! It's a Spongebob reference, okay. And what about um, Yoonhae? Is that her name? Yoonhae? How like she's surrounded by broken mirrors. Honey, I don't know what kind of fun house you're in. I suggest you get your money back and get the fuck out of there. And before I say the second view, I kind of want to talk about the lyrics first. The lyrics basically talk about how the girls are scared and they're feared and they feel like they want to change themselves. And I feel like a lot of us deal with that too, where we feel very insecure. We're always afraid that people around us are always judging us. You know, they don't really like us. Like, it's, 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 it's a thing that everyone can deal with eventually i feel like the girls have accepted themselves because there was a line in the song that says i'm not going to stop this strange dance i i, I feel like this is their way of saying you know i'm not going to stop being myself so like you know how like at first you know jay kyung is a little bit scared to like go into the water and she finally lays down in the water she's like yep this is me or how the girls just confidently walk away from the people and they're just like the lyrics are pretty, pretty deep, and the song is amazing as well. Good job, Rainbow. Another view that I am going to talk about is a little bit more serious. I have heard um, from several people, I actually saw a post on Tumblr, um, that people with mental illnesses felt very uncomfortable watching this video, saying that it kind of triggered them. And it made them feel unstable for the rest of the day. So I'm just giving you out a warning out there. If you have a mental illness and you do not feel comfortable watching other people having mental breakdowns, especially if it's a K-pop video, then I am giving you a big warning. Be safe because K-pop videos, like, like I'm saying, K-pop videos are not for everyone. You know, there'll be K-pop videos where like there's just too many flashing lights and that cannot be good for people who have epilepsy or are prone to seizures or how... how they always have spiders. I'm not afraid of spiders, but I know a lot of people who have a strong, strong fear of spiders. And that is not to be made fun of, and neither should be mental illnesses. So if you have a mental illness and you do not feel comfortable watching people have a mental breakdown, I'm giving you a warning. Be safe. Support the group. Love Rainbow. Support their comeback. You can all do that, but just be safe, okay? Good. Now the dance, dear freaking goodness, can we talk about that dance though? All that classy ass dancing moves, especially Jay Kyung, which was like pretending to be a swan. So, so, I haven't done ballet in seven years, don't judge me. And that booty though, like all that booty moving. Like put some Tchaikovsky music up in here, like be a swan, okay. All I want to say is good job Rainbow. This is amazing and I know you guys haven't been around for two years, so it's great to have you back. And I wish you guys lots of luck. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and I'm going to see you all soon. Bye, guys.